spoke about the distempered exposure, and 53 dogs went to rescues while more than a dozen were euthanized. At that time, OAC cleaned out the shelter to get rid of the disease. Now two dogs died overnight, and the decision was made to euthanize all of them. More than 140 dogs are in trouble at Odessa Animal Control. After a run-in with distemper, a decision was made to euthanize all the dogs, even those who had the distemper vaccination. I received this information and I put out a post letting the public know that this was what was going to be going on and that all the animals in both buildings would lose their life. This is the post Clark is talking about. Nearly 500 shares and just one share made it into the right hands. I received a call from um, Austin Pets Alive saying they wanted to come and help. They said uh, that because of my post that every dog would be saved. Every healthy dog will be saved. Those with this temper will be euthanized. Because we don't want to send any dogs with this temper out into the community. It's a highly contagious disease. And um, it's, it's very unforgiving. And it's a very horrific disease with, you know, neurological consequences. And it's very difficult to recover. This is not the first time OAC has had a distemper outbreak. Five years ago, a similar situation unfolded. And that time, no dogs were saved. The difference between then and now is that that we vaccinate on intake for every animal and we also parvo test on intake and every animal that leaves that shelter will go out spayed and neutered vaccinated and chipped that's a far cry from where we were five years ago and we're really proud of that and the problem is not at the facility the problem is in the community with not vaccinating your animals Austin Pets Alive will be arriving in Odessa tomorrow to help OAC treat animals, clear out the shelter, and clean the shelter. Live in the studio, Haley Brooks, Big 2 News.